Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. This is Misty Caldwell with Sunshine and Dark Times Daily Devotional. Today is Friday, June the 19th, and our devotional today is called The Brevity of Life. Our scripture is found in James 4, 14, which says, What is your life? You are a mist that appears for a little while and then vanishes. Several years ago, a university student asked me what had been my biggest surprise in life. Immediately, I replied, the brevity of life. Almost before we know it, the years have passed and life is almost over. On one hand, life's brevity should challenge us. If ever we are to live for Christ and share him with others, it must be now. Jesus said, the night is coming when no one can work. John 9, 4. But life's brevity should also comfort us. Life is short and before us is eternity. When sufferings overwhelm us or difficulties assail us, we know that they soon will be over. Paul wrote, Our light affliction, which is but for a moment, is working for us a far more exceeding and eternal weight of glory. For the things which are seen are temporary. 2 Corinthians 4, 17-18 Don't live as if this life will continue forever. It won't. Live instead with eternity in view. Hope for today. You promise a harvest, Lord, to those who don't give up. Galatians 6, 9. Give me the endurance to finish strong. I want to look back and know that I didn't waste a single moment that you gave me. Guys, I think this devotional is just, just absolutely wonderful. It may not touch your heart or reach you in like in a place where I am today because last night my husband and I went to a funeral. Um, my best friend's grandfather passed away, Mr. Leroy McIntyre, and it was just a reminder of how short life is. Um, he was 75 years old when he died, which to many seems like such a long life, but the definition of brevity is a shortness of time or a briefness. Obviously, that's not the exact word-for-word -word definition by Webster, but in its entirety, it means a briefness or how short this life is. And although um, Mr. McIntyre was 75 years old, you you blink your eyes once and you're five and then you blink and you're 95. And because this life is so short and we are given such precious but few time to make memories and make this life count. Um, and in that time that we are given, we need to spend sharing the love of God with others and bringing a light to such a dark world. Um, I know that this devotional today speaks on that, that Brevity challenges us to reach the world and share Christ and all of the things that he has done for us and and bring more souls into the kingdom of heaven. But also it is such a comfort to us because this world is tough, guys. It's hard. Um, it has heartbreaks. It has um, struggles and battles. And of course, with the way that the world is today, it's not fair and, and we feel just depressed and sad and overwhelmed and it says that if difficulties assail us we know it will soon be over because guys we are promised an eternity with Jesus in heaven and it is going to be so awesome. Uh, my grandmother passed away in December and my best friend's grandfather just passed away this week and life is fleeting and and they go far too soon but my goodness, the reunion that we're going to have with them in heaven. So guys, let's take the brevity of life, take that shortness and make it worth something. Um, I want to look back and know that I didn't waste a single moment that you gave me, God. So guys, let's cling to that today and make the most of every moment that God gives us and spread his light and his joy. Um, Again, happy Friday to you all. I hope you have an amazing weekend. Thank you so much for listening, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.